we're going to show you how to plank using the Opti Gym Ball. This exercise will strengthen your core and is good for hip and shoulder stability and will help develop those abs. Get into plank position like Michelle here, keeping your toes on the ground and resting your elbow, forearm and hands on the stability ball. Find your balance, this can be the tricky bit. Keep those hips raised up off the ground. Keeping those feet firmly on the floor with a wide stance and your back long and straight. No sticking bottoms in the air. And remember to squeeze your abdominal muscles for the best results. If you can hold the plank for 30 seconds, rest for a minute and repeat up to six times. Nearly there, Michelle, you can do it. Try and hold the plank a little bit longer until you reach the thick. So now, take your Opti Gym Ball and Band and we're gonna show you how to do banded oblique twists. This really works at defining your abs and oblique muscles, as well as improving your balance and stability. Start by sitting on the floor with a stability ball behind you like Michelle is doing. Hold the resistance band at both ends and rest the middle of your back against the ball with your feet flat on the floor, raise your hips. Now lift your arms above your chest, stretching the band. Hold that tension, Michelle, you're doing great. Slowly twist your upper body from left to right. And again, left to right. Twisting for about a minute or so, or as long as you feel comfortable. Keep the tension in the band and keep your abs tight and your hips raised. Don't slouch. That's good. Rest and repeat five times. We're going to do a stability ball dumbbell press using the Opti Gym Ball and these dumbbells. Start by sitting on the floor with the ball behind you and a weight in each hand. Rest the middle of your back on your stability ball and keep your feet firmly on the floor, raising your hips. Lift your arms above your chest and slowly bend your arms to lower the dumbbells. Keeping the movement controlled, push the weights back up and again, keeping those abs nice and tight and your hips raised push those dumbbells away from your chest. Come on, Michelle, you can do it. Just a couple more. Working large muscle groups individually like this helps burn more calories. This exercise is also great for increasing your chest and upper body strength, as well as improving your balance and stability of your upper body. You need to do 10 to 15 reps of this exercise, building up to 15 if you can't manage that. Do four sets, then rest for a minute or two, depending upon your ability. For these alternating glute raises, you'll need your Opti Gym Ball and your ankle weights. As well as shaping and toning your glutes, this exercise works your abdominal muscles to improve your balance. Face down, keeping your hands on the floor and putting both feet on the stability ball with your legs out straight. Just do what Michelle is doing. Lift one foot off the ball and raise it towards the ceiling. With those abdominals braced and your back completely straight, slowly move your ankle up and down just a few inches. Keep going until you can really feel the burn and then swap legs. Try and do 10 to 15 reps on each leg. Then rest for a minute or more if you need it. Go again for three sets. 